Hello everyone, welcome back, Dom here and this video is the first video of a new series of videos that I'm planning to release every now and then and all these videos will come from questions that you guys leave me in the comments down below. And the name of this series is going to be called Cubase Minute. So what I'm going to do in this series, I'm going to try and find questions that you leave me in the comments down below that come up every now and then. I'm going to try and answer this question in as little time as possible, if possible, in just a minute. So that you can get to the answer very easily without having to watch a 15 minute video or a 30 minute video. How about that? So I cannot promise I'm going to always hit the one minute mark. But I'm gonna do my best. So on this first video, I'm going to address a question that I get all the time. And this is how to create group channels or buses in Cubase. So timer. Let's say that you have some drums. Let's say you have a kick drum, snare, hi-hats, an entire drum kit, multiple microphones, or you have multiple vocals or guitars and you want to group them so that you can add the same processing to them, like a compressor, an EQ, stuff like this, how do you do this? And there are quite a few ways to do this, but the fastest one is this one. First, you select all the channels that you want to include in the group. For example, I'm going to select my kick drum and then I'm going to hit shift and select my hi-hat. Now, if I want to include this kick drum up here in the selection, I hit the control key on Windows or command key on the Mac and now I've selected this one. Now, press F3. When you get into the mixer, don't press anything. Instead, right click on one of the channels right here and say add group channel to selected channels. Then this dialog pops up and this is where you select if your group is going to be stereo or mono and then I name my group. And boom, we just created our drum bus, our drum group. So now if I hit solo, you will see that only my drums are going to play. And that's how you create group tracks inside Cubase. There are many other ways, this is the fastest. If you like these super fast tutorials, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the bell notification icon, and let me know in the comments down below what you'd like me to do next in the next Cubase Minute. See you next time, bye-bye.